What is up guys, Rekas here with a new video and today I want to show you guys what is probably the biggest bug I've ever found in Idle Heroes. Couldn't get confirmation from the age on this matter, um, but we're still going to look at it and I think, uh, well, it does speak for itself. So what you see in the background is actually the video where I and some viewers from the comments spotted this. Uh, it is my 33 million attack Estia Starving Jara vs. Shadow SL video and we're going to watch Sealand level 31 um, stage one. So the first stage of Sealand level 31 and then we're going to watch Sealand level 32 stage one. So the first fight one level higher. And naturally you would assume that the HP of those fights increases. So you have the HP of Sealand level 31 and at 32 there is high HP. So let's just watch the fights for now. Starting off Sealand level 31 stage one, you just observe the HP, just observe um, how well my team performs and well there are no big changes in between we switch um, to attribute reduction which doesn't really matter shouldn't inflict the fight a lot you can see here turn two um, starting off with all enemies still alive though cc'd um, and well fight is going pretty well in general you can say that clearing here by turn three Let's take a look at those damage numbers, keep those in mind. 77 um, billion here on the Azrael, and then we have 142 billion on the Starwinger. And um, those are our numbers for now. And well, let's just see how well the team performed against this same stage, one level higher. So as you can see, Sealand level 32 here now, first stage again. Same team, no real power change. As I said, we switched to attribute reduction. Uh, and here, already on turn one, first kill. And there it is done. Stage two, basically not even reached by them. And you can see the damage numbers here. 33 uh, billion, 46 billion. Way lower. Way lower. This is 40 billion lower than before. This is 100 billion lower than before. And that had me a bit confused. And some people from the comments as well said like, well, you got way lower damage numbers there. I was like, well, the fight certainly doesn't look like it, does it? I mean, just starting off here, we can watch the fight again. Um, you can instantly see this one shot and that just didn't happen in this uh, fight against stage 31. And I was like, okay, hmm, that's interesting. Let's investigate a little bit. And that's exactly what I did. I investigated a little bit with the help of Tussibot. And um, this is what I found. So if you don't know Tussibot yet, Tussibot is a bot made by Ica. It's available on my server. And one of the commands uh, is enemy stats. And there are several um, enemy stats commands for different areas of the game. This one is for Sealand. It can give you every single stat of every single enemy in Sealand, what skills they use, what the skill, uh, their skills do. And you can find out everything about those enemies. Uh, with fairly with ease. Um, given this command, enemy stats sealant is available from uh, YouTube members only. So if you have a membership of my channel, well, then you can use that. Other than that, I made screenshots of all of this stuff I want to show you guys, of course. So uh, let's take a look at that. Now you can see sealant 31.1-1 with basically 49 billion HP per enemy. Um, and then we look at sealant 32.1 and it's 18 billion. 18 billion. Um, so basically 60% lower than Sealand 31. This is a pretty unexpected drop here. Um, beyond that, well, we have an expected increase in attack, 1 million more attack, um, but the drop of HP quite substantial here. Um, in fact, it is so substantial that the HP of this Sealand 32 at 18 billion is between the HP of Sealand 28 and 29. So, um, 50% more than Sealand 28 um, and well a bit less, 25% less I think it is, uh, than 29. So between 28 and 29 despite us of course being here at uh, Sealand 32, so way higher than that. And this is in fact uh, the case in all Sealand. So it's not just a Shadow Sealand, we can take a look here. Um, there we have Light um, and basically the same, Fortress which is even lower. <laughs> that is insane, 11 billion. Uh, I think Fortress in general is a bit lower because the other number is lower as well, but it is the same there. Forest, same situation. Dark, same situation. Abyss, also the same situation. So all of those are way lower um, than expected on Sealand 32. And um, 
well, the, the being, HP being between 28 and 29 certainly, uh, I, in my opinion, can't be intended. I asked the age about this. I've not gotten an answer yet. Still want to show you guys this video. Um, if there is anything to add to that, if I get an answer, I will actually pin a comment down below. Um, and this is not the only thing that is a little bit weird. We take a look back at the numbers here. Um, CLN 31 to CLN 32. Well, it decreases here. But the number it actually increases to at 33, so one stage later, is also kind of weird, I think. Because if we compare 31 and 33, um, those are basically the same HP numbers. They are so similar, it's actually insane. Um, and well, you could think like, okay, maybe um, it's just the same HP number, but um, well, the attack goes up. Well, this is not exactly the case. If we gen then compare the HP of Sealand 33 to uh, Sealand 34 and 35, we will find something quite surprising. So 49 billion here, and it's 152 billion at Sealand 34. So no, uh, no question that this is difficult, and you notice that in game. We got stuck on 34. Uh, it's three times as high as on 33, and nearly 10 times as high as 32. And then we go to 35 and it straight up doubles again, even more than doubles, to 332 billion, which is absolutely insane. Uh, and nearly 20 times the HP we have on CLN 32. Uh, the attack pretty much linearly increases all the time, so this makes sense. The HP values, first being like 49, then 18, then 49 again, then 152, uh, 332, don't really make sense. You would expect that to be more linear. Um, and there not being a difficulty drop at 32. So that kind of makes it unintended for me. I think um, I, have, I have no idea how, why this is actually the case, if they did anything wrong in the code. Um, but I think like, I don't think any of those stages is intended to have the HP we see at uh, 32. This is just too low if you compare it to 28 and 29. Doesn't make much sense. Um, and I think they should increase all the time. I think that was the intended way. Um, still, kind of interesting what you find out while doing some random video on Sealand, um, just having some fun with the 30 million, uh, 3 million attack starring Jorah. Um, I think they will fix that. Well, now they know about it, I guess, because of me. Um, and give that a more, more linear... Uh, increase. Um, what I would care about now and what in, uh, has me kind of curious is uh, are any of you guys stuck at Sealand 32? Because I would imagine that if you can clear Sealand 31 then you can clear 32. Given in the video we saw that the enemies at 32 did in fact deal damage to me while those at 31 didn't because they well they have one million attack more so that is quite substantial at this level if you go from 3.4 to 4.4 million that is a lot, um, but like, I would still imagine that if you have the damage to clear 49 billion HP, well, you just have to get one good attack to clear 32, right? So, uh, if you are stuck at 32 indeed, uh, well, let me know in the comments, I'm pretty curious to see that. Uh, and also, what is your highest sealant at this point? Uh, I mean, with the divine power, did that help you in any way? Maybe you should write something about that in the comments. I would be very curious to see that. Other than that, if you care for to see Lagobot, um, we have a free version on the Discord server. You find the link in the description, and that includes a lot of um, commands already, including some of the ones that are usually paid. Made those free on my server, and then we have the premium version for the YouTube members. So if you care about any of this, um, make sure to check it out. In my uh, opinion, to see what is still one of the best. Um, sources of information we have in Idle Heroes, in the Idle Heroes community. So uh, you should definitely use it uh, for something, a tenant calculation or anything like that. Uh, just makes sense and it's the best source for that. So with that, I wish you guys a great day and we'll see us in the next one.